I believe we should enjoy our journey and not take ourselves too seriously. After a day out at sea, our boat began leaking. And every time a big wave came, people would rush to drain water off the boat to keep it from sinking. After two days, our engine failed and we essentially began drifting. Now on the third day, we were hungry, we were thirsty. We were running out of food and running out of water. When suddenly we saw a boat come towards us from a distance, we were so happy, thinking we were saved. We jumped up and down calling for the boat's attention. But as the boat got closer and closer, however, we realised it was a fishing boat. And at that point in time, in that part of the water, it meant only one thing, pirates. In 2005, I was delighted, thrilled, honoured, surprised to receive the Young Australian of the Year Award. I guess surprised because previous recipients of this award have been people like Lane Hewitt, Ian Thorpe, Kathy Freeman, and I'd never expected someone from my world to ever receive this award. And I wasn't sure how I was gonna handle it all. See, in days, I found myself everywhere. Newspapers, radio, television. I went to dinner with the Prince and Princess of Denmark. You should have been at this dinner. <laughs> there were like five knives and five forks on each side. And I just wanted to put up my hand and go, can I have a pair of chopsticks? <laughs> what I realized as I was growing up, is when you focus on what you have rather than on what you're lacking and you're grateful for it and see exactly where it is that you want to be, then anything is possible.